Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In the previous video, we have completed all the app user APIs of Article Hub project. If you are not seen that video, just go to description and check out the link. In this video, we are going to work on category API. So let us start with that. So here in the routes, we have to create a new file and here we have to write category dot js press enter after that here we just need to uh, also create the table so go to the table dot uh, sql file and here we have to write the query to create the table so create table category and id int primary key and it should be auto increment and the name where care 255 not null and put semicolon at the end just copy this one and go to the mysql database and just paste it over here and press enter so it will create a table for us so just you can see the description of the table now get back to the uh, category.js file as our table has been created now here we have to write const express and require and here we have to write express framework we need to import express after that we need to import the connection connection require and here we need to import connection file and after that we need to write router and express dot router this one and we also need to import the as we have to put uh, uh, secure our API so authentications required so require and we just need to import the service that is authentication service and after that here we have to write router dot post method and the first API that will be for to add new category add new category and auth dot authentication and here request response next and inside this one let category is equals to request from the request body we are going to get the values body and here we have to write query so insert into category and after that we have to insert the name values just post a question mark and put same equal after that we have to create the connection query and inside this one we need to pass the query And we also need to pass the category dot name. And after that, if any error occur or results, we just need to. And here, inside this one, if there's a no error occur, in that case, else we have to return response dot status with 500 dot json and error we are going to return and here we have to return response dot status and 200 and json with message message category added success successfully and just save this and after that we also need to export so here we have to write module dot exports is equals to router this one save this now we have to go to the index.js file as we have need to import that category over here so const and here we have to write category route require and here we have to routes slash category 
dot js and here app dot use and here we have to write category category and then we have to write category routes and then save this you can see database has connected successfully we are getting message now let's uh, copy this one category over here and uh, after that the path this one add new category we also need to copy at this place and this will be the post api we also need a token so we are going to get this token and we are going to paste it over in authorization we have we have a token click on it just paste the token over here and after that we have to go to the body and we have to change this one and here we are going to change this to java and i'm going to send this so you can see category added successfully we are getting message so let's check out the database from our uh, category you can see we are getting id1 java it means that our add new category api is working fine as expected so now we are going to write the api to uh, okay we'll add more some more uh, here so as we are going to use a get api right going to write the get api for that tasting okay so get let's uh, scroll this one little bit and here we are going to write get all category and here we also need to auth dot authentication and request response next and here in this one we have to write the query so query and here we have to write select star from category order by name so the it will automatically arrange by uh, actually um, by the first letter or order by name actually okay so after that we have to write connection query and inside this one we need to pass the query and error results and here we have to write if there's a no error if there's a no error in that case else we are going to return whatever the error we get so status with the 500 and dot json and whatever the error we get in if condition we are going to return whatever the result we get so response dot status 200 and in the json we are going to result the results return the result just save this now let's test this api so i'm going to paste change this at this place i'm going to change this to get api i'm going to hit the API. now you can see we are getting this too you can see at the first position as we have set order as a name so it's showing c first then it's showing the name java right so that's why it's id 2 and 1 is showing right currently okay so it means that get all category api is also working as expected now we have to write the api to update the category so let's scroll a little bit and router now here router dot post method and here we have to write update category and auth dot authentication and request response next and here we have to write lit category request dot body body and after that we have to pass the query so update category set name is where id is this one and then we have to create the connection query then we have to pass the query and here we have to pass the category dot name after that category dot id and error results then we have to if there is no error occur 
in that case else we are going to return return response dot status with 500 and json and whatever the error we get we are going to return it okay and in if condition if update query executed successfully it means in that case affected raw raw will be not equals to zero if it is zero it means that it's not updated it means that our id which we have sent it that is wrong so here in that case we are going to return with the response dot status at 404 404 with the json and inside the json we have to write message category id does not found we are going to return this error semicolon and outside of the if condition we are going to return the response that that uh, our data has been updated so here I'm going to write message category updated success put semicolon just save this let's copy this one name go over here just change this to this one go to the body and here we are going to write here id and uh, id i'm going to pass the wrong id first so i'm going to write here 45 and here in the name i'm going to pass the dash and i'm going to try to send this you can see okay we are getting error because this api does not exist in the gate we have to change this to post try to hit the game you can see category id does not found we are getting this message with the error 404 not found okay so here i'm going to change this to 2 and try to send it you can see category updated successfully okay i'm going to revert this one and i'm going to hit the api okay i'm going to change this to get again you can see we are getting the values updated the values it means that our update category API is working fine as expected. So this is all about the category APIs of Article Hub project. I hope you guys like this video. Please hit like and subscribe my channel. Thank you.